How are you doing guys? It's Larry here from LB Fitness and today we're going to show you with Ian, who's uh, quite nervous, and Carl, why you're experiencing lower back pain. So lads, stop being so giddy, okay? So what we're going to do in today's video and the next couple of series of videos, we're going to show you some key issues that athletes are experiencing at this time of the year. Firstly, Ian is back in college, being a brat, and so is Carl. And they're experiencing from being, sit, going from standing, walking around all day, from moving, sit down there, Carl. Um, sit down there, um, Ian. They're experiencing, they're sitting down all day, all the time now. So they're now slouching more. So Ian, Cottle especially, who's, you're still in school, he's slouching a lot. So if Cottle, you turn a bit more to the side so you can see in the camera. There you go. You can look at the camera if you want. Um, you can see Cottle is at the moment slouched here in this position. So you can see this is called his thoracic spine. He's slouched over. You can see it in Ian as well. And then also, in this position, because Cottle's sitting in school eight hours a day, isn't it? Um, so eight hours a day, his hip flexors are getting quite tight and quite short. And so if you stand up, so then when he stands up and walks around and the lads try and basically go running, they're now over-exaggerating. It's hard. You might see it turn sideways to the camera, lads. So they're in pretty much this position. So a lot of pressure on your lower back. If you do this yourselves, push your ass out and then hunch over, you'll feel an extreme amount of pressure going on your lower back. You can see it more so in Cuttle and Ian. We've been working on their lads' posture and it's been improving, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it used to be much worse. Okay, so what we're gonna show you guys is a quick um, activation warm. So movement is key. You can spend so long doing foam rolling, etc. Lads, do you wanna grab your uh, positions down there? Okay. Okay guys, so now we're gonna run into real quickly the exercise that the lads are doing. Bring your foot out a little bit further, Cuttle. So we call this a grinder. It's a bit of a lunge complex. So what you can see the lads behind, his back leg is dead straight and he's squeezing his quad. So Ian here is squeezing his quad. This shin, make sure it's straight to the ground. Come out here with the foot. Bring the foot out here. Push that knee back, good. You can see Cuttle is struggling a bit more with it. So straighten the back leg, Cuttle. Here guys, in this position also, while you're here, this knee is driven out, that's why it's called groin. His foot is flat on the floor, elbow runs down to the inside, then you reach and look up. The reason for the hand movement and looking up is when you reach up, you're reaching up and looking up at the sky, do two more, and you're squeezing the shoulder blade, look up, Ian. Do you feel that squeeze here? Yep. So by reaching here, up here, you're then actually opening up the thoracic spine. So by doing that, guys, you're actually opening up your thoracic spine at the same time. So going from this position, the back leg, keep it going, guys. Do the other side. The back leg, you open up the, the hip flexor muscle. The front leg, you open up the hamstring and the glute by using movement. And then with the reach, you're igniting your thoracic spine and then bringing yourself from this position into this upright position. As well, it's an activation warmer. Okay, guys, so the next one now, we're gonna try and open up the posterior chain, so hamstrings. But also while we're doing that, we're gonna get some core activation. So one of the problems we have from slouching all day is that from slouching in this position, we have no core, deep core activation. So then for when we run, we're not able to execute the movement. So the second warm-up drill, you can use this as an activation warm, so more of a dynamic stretch. So it's inch worms. You know what you're doing, lads? Yeah. Let's go. So the lads have been slowly working on this. It has been a lot, lot worse. They walk with their hands straight out, okay? Don't even bother doing the push-ups for now, lads. Let's keep it basic. So don't bother with the push-up and then walk the toes in. Lads, when you're doing it next, will you just hold that plank position, the high plank position? Let's go again. So lads are gonna do it again. So hold there, lads. Squeeze, squeeze the glutes. So right now, the lads are getting some deep core activation, but they're also getting some glute activation. So squeeze the glutes as hard as you can. Squeeze harder, harder. Good, pull on your hands as well. Do you feel that in your abs? Yeah. Say it louder. Yeah. Yeah, good. Do you feel that in your glutes? Yeah. Good, now walk your hands back in and get a stretch, or walk your toes in, whichever choice. Hold that there, and as well at the same time, do you feel a stretch in the back of your legs? Yeah. Good, walk your hands out again and repeat. Walk your hands out as Ian is doing it. Hold there Ian, squeeze the glutes, pull on the hands, core activation, squeeze the glutes hard as you can, and continue, do that 10 reps. Okay guys, keep on continuing on, go down one way and then go back to it. So guys, you can see there, that what they're doing now is they're doing some deep core activation. So they're now stabilizing the core and glutes in the new pattern that they're doing. Keep your hips up in and squeeze the glutes. What you want to do is you want to do at least two rounds of this. So firstly, the groiners that we're doing, elbow in, reach up and rotate, open up that thoracic spine. 10 reps either side, then do this 10, 10 times and do that for two sets. And you should feel a drastic improvement in your ability to be able to run using the right motor control. Try that guys, it should reveal your lower back pain. If not, I'll send you on another video. 
P.S. guys, just a real quick note. If you do message me or any of the lads on Jump the Gun, we may be a while getting back to you, but we will get back to you um, either in some kind of video version or we will contact you um, via email or private phone call. Again, we might have quite a few um, inquiries, but again, we're trying to give you free advice, so please be patient with us and we will get on to you as soon as possible. But do keep an eye on Jump in the Gun page and LB Fitness um, personal training page. Like the YouTube channel, and you should get loads of valuable content on there, which is free, guys. Um, so don't be afraid to like the YouTube page and um, work from there. So just look, search for Larry Brady PT slash LB Fitness, or look on our Facebook page, and you should be able to find it. So just please be patient with us, guys, and we will help you as soon as we can.